It's Daxon again with a quick guide for Warhammer 40k Dawn of War, Mission 4 of the campaign destroyed the Xenos on insane difficulty. Toggle ceasefire stance on your whirlwind tanks and target fire each building in the orc camp below. Select your assault squads and use the jump command to descend on the remaining orcs. Capture the strategic point and use your two servitors to repair the stronghold, armory, barracks, and generator buildings that have spawned in. Remember to hold shift to queue multiple actions. Add a listening post, fortify it, and build a turret just above your stronghold to fend off enemy drops. Build a second generator and queue two space marines. When the marines finish, reinforce and push southeast, claiming the strategic point here and building a listening post. At the armory, add bionics for marine health and target finders for accuracy. Push east to claim another strategic point and build a listening post. Follow the path north and jump up with your assault squads to claim another strategic point. Upgrade your stronghold to a monastery, increase the pop cap twice, and queue five space marine squads. Grab the heavy weapons upgrade, enhance target finders for faster vehicle kills, and bionics two to strengthen marines. Build a machine cult, increase vehicle cap, and add the generator upgrade. Fill all your squads with reinforcements and two to one missile launchers to plasma guns as you advance to the first red circle. When you get to the water line in the Kill a Can, hold a line out of range of most of the buildings and push in slowly, taking out pushing infantry and always switch to the Kill a Can or Heavy Mech if they engage your forces. Once the first base is destroyed, increase vehicle cap again at your monastery and build six dreadnoughts. When the dreadnoughts finish, push to the north of the map just before a long bridge and add leaders to your squads to help restore morale. Push your hero and dreadnoughts in and engage the Squigoth for long enough that his own tanks advance to block his escape. Keep your missiles on the Squigoth until he falls, replacing units and restoring morale by tabbing through your squads. Proceed north to take out two buildings and a pile of guns and then continue up the ramp to take out the second base. Switch to the Warboss when you see him, though he has the annoying tendency to run away. While it's true that building an advanced base will hasten reinforcements, the easiest way to complete the optional objective in this mission is just to build a second stronghold right next to the original one. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, subscribe to get updates when I post new content, and I will see you all in the next video.